So, magnets do all kinds of cool shit. It's a bottle with some um, gallium in it, and I, I just play them with the gallium, but there's a little, little chunk of uh, broken magnet in there and some AUPT dust, which is a gold platinum alloy. <clears throat> and it's uh, not rare or hard to find. You can dig it up in any creek sand and sift the sand. And it's the only gold stuff that sticks to a magnet. Um, so I, I play with magnets a lot because magnetic energy is what superconductors conduct, not electricity. And uh, AUPT is a superconductor for magnetism and heat. The river rocks, uh, the ones that are magnetic, kind of magnetic, sort of magnetic, they're diamagnetic. They create a, an opposing force to an applied magnetic field. So if you stick a magnet on them, they'll sort of stick and they, and they come off pretty easy, not like not like, uh, not like this. <coughs> you know, I've really got to put some effort to separate two magnets or, or to separate a uh, piece of steel. Steel has resistance to magnetic energy, so it um, stays put. And if you put that screw on top of something like this bar magnet, it's going to hold that son of a gun right there. And um, you can thread that nut on, stick the stick on, and then thread the nut on, you know, by turning the stick over and putting the, uh, the bolt down into it and then screwing the uh, nut on with another set of magnets. Maybe the same set of magnets, because you don't want to pull it off, I guess. Anyway, it, it, that's how you do it. 